Curricular fair is a way for any clubs and any sports that are occurring in the season to get together in one gym and allow the students and the alumni to get together and learn what opportunities are available for them. Well, Student Council is, uh, is a service club. It's a uh, it's a great organization that we have here at the high school that is uh, very important to the way that the high school runs. It's one of those things where a lot of high schools have representation of students that uh, take part in community events, take uh, part in community decisions. Um, everything having to do with the high school. It's one of those clubs that actually we're very proud to say that we're the only club that any decision that we make, anything that we do, represents the high school directly, uh, influences the high school directly, and just has to do with the high school. A lot of other clubs have to do with, you know, are, are based in other schools, based in other areas, are part of a larger assumption. We are just specific to DY, and that's one thing that we love is that everything that we do is seen directly here, and the changes that we make here are things that we can uh, quantify. This year, about 10 to 15 clubs participated. Um, I'm pretty sure that's not all of them, but a big majority of them. And hopefully next year, we can get all of them to sign up and participate. Uh, so French Club is essentially just uh, a gathering of people. Uh, every Tuesday, uh, in Madame Boyle's room, uh, we get together and we really just uh, discuss, you know, uh, anything French-related, France-related. Uh, you know, from culture to language uh, to history. Uh, and right now our main focus is a uh, trip. We have a trip plan in February uh, where a number of us are going to go to Paris. So right now we're just kind of uh, hammering out the details of that. And I feel like uh, the French club stands out because it has, everyone, everyone that's in it has a passion for, for, for France and its, its culture. And so if you have even, you know, an inkling of an interest in France and, and uh, you know, the various matters having to do with France and its culture, uh, come in, take a look, you know, we'll sit you down and, and, and see what, you know, what you're all about and, you know, there's no entrance, you know, fee or, or, or exam, just kind of come on by and talk to us about France and, yeah. Okay, the DY Theater Company is a group of fun-loving people who are just looking to have a good time and play crazy characters, yep. and it's just a lot of fun. We put on plays and we put on musicals. The plays are usually in the fall or winter, and the musicals are usually in the spring, so it's a lot of fun. Yeah. It's a chance to be yourself and be someone other than yourself, and it's a great opportunity to just really come out of your shell and get out there and have fun. And what I hope to accomplish was inform all the students of the opportunities, clubs, sports available to them. That way they can better participate in their school. And the goal is not to have students go home at 204 every day, but somehow stay after and contribute back to the school community. The German Club is a group of students who are interested in promoting um, German traditions and German language and um, they also are interested in traveling to Germany, so we sponsor the German Exchange. We sell German chocolate and gummy bears. Um, we're going to have a new um, activity. We're going to be selling chocolate Santa Clauses for Nikolaus, which is on December 6th, and um, we hold annually our Schnitzel Fest, that's our big uh, fundraiser and event that'll be in February where we actually cook prepare cook and serve a German meal and we provide entertainment with dancing and singing if you're interested in anything German um, language culture travel um, just like to get together with a good active group of people um, then German Club would be right for you. This co-curricular fair, I mean, has a lot of positive effects on the school, but one of them is it allows for a tighter school community in a way where every student's participating in a club that relates to the school or sport and just makes the school environment a better place. The National Art Honor Society is a group where the artistic students of DY or anyone who's upholding an art grade um, can join the club and express their talent through art in this after school activity. We volunteer for community service um, in and out of DY. 
We paint faces and we take part in many of the parades around uh, Cape Cod. You should join the National Art Honor Society because we have a great group of kids and we're all working together and just expressing the school through art. To conclude, the co-curricular fair was a huge success. It was designed to advertise clubs and sports, but it did way more than that. It allowed students to realize what opportunities are available. And for the most part, I hear from the clubs and sports that a lot of people join and that they would really like to participate next year.